being a successful entrepreneur is not a easy task when it comes to the vision a lot of people get confused between being an entrepreneur and being a businessman so there has to be a vision and it's only the vision that drives you to be a successful entrepreneur now to be a successful entrepreneur it's very very important that your vision should be very very broad very very huge it should not be to earn a living to have a luxurious life but far beyond that if you have an objective in mind if you have a goal in mind there is no reason that you would stop so being a successful entrepreneur start with three basic concepts that we would understand today first is never be afraid of your failures every successful person be it an educational entrepreneur or any other entrepreneur had a series of failures in the life only with those failures you drive your strength and it's well known that success does not come all at once so when you have the cycle that moves the wheel of the cycle goes up and down and so is the series of success and failures with a series of failures you would attain fewer success but that's totally fine until and unless you have the strength to face those failures and it's very important not to get uh, broken by the failures that come up the next important thing is do not pause never stop specifically when you are aiming to be an educational entrepreneur you have to be updated you have to keep yourself very much dynamic to face the real challenges and unless and until you do that you cannot be successful to be successful it's very very important that you keep moving and do not stop once you stop your goals your motivation your uh, further efforts would get blocked and remember you stop only and only when you are uh, afraid about something you feel you have failed in some of the aspects but if you want to succeed you have to move forward beyond that so never ever pause keep moving keep working the next important thing that we focus to be a successful entrepreneur is your problems are your strength people often come complaining saying that we have so much trouble in life this happened that happened but all those things that have happened have been the reason you are you that means your strengths have been coming from your problems so don't think your problem to be big consider your problems to be the path for your strength and your strength would automatically be derived once you start this problem solving approach rather than being a problem centric approach or rather than being having a problem centric approach move forward with a problem solving approach a sailor never ever stops in the middle of the sea he knows there are waves there is tide but still he knows he has a home on the other shore and he has to reach there so despite of all the adversities that are in the way he keeps sailing to reach the shore and that's something that you need to keep in mind despite of all the problems in your life you have to keep moving and remember these problems would give you strength and would be the reason for you to develop as a successful entrepreneur and once you are a successful entrepreneur it's not not just you the people surrounding you the people working from you derive strength from you and therefore it's not just the wellness of a segment of people but a huge segment of people who are being influenced so remember to be successful never pause derive strength from your problems and don't be afraid of failures in life don't be afraid that you would have to tell about your failures to someone in life it's to totally fine we would be covering many interesting lectures stay tuned have a wonderful day